Next week, the Utah lacrosse team will make history when they play their first game ever in, as a Division I sport. Dana Green went out to practice today and has more. Brian Holman was a national championship winning assistant coach at North Carolina, but two years ago when the opportunity arose to take the Utes program from a club team to a Division I team, he couldn't pass it up. It's a once in a lifetime type of thing, so, and it's been... Literally from day we've the first day we got here till now, it's just it's been like that. You know, the people have been great, the community's great, the school's been awesome. Uh, the coaching staff here is incredible. Um, that, that was immediately caught my eye, and, and just an opportunity to play for guys like them, and, and just learn and grow as a lacrosse player was an awesome opportunity. As the westernmost Division One team in the entire country, the Utes players come not only from Utah but also from 18 states and Canada, all with a chip on their shoulder. Most of us were like the bottom of like division one recruiting or we didn't get recruited at all for division one so it's like it's not that we have something to prove i mean like we're a blue collar group like we don't play very pretty all the time but like we get down and we just never give up as the newest of 72 division one lacrosse programs in the country the Utes are obviously facing a lot of challenges but scheduling is not one of them they're playing some of the top teams in the country like duke virginia and umass our goal here is simple you know we, we want to build a national championship caliber program we want to go show our kids what these teams look like how they act you know how they're prepared it's not like scary but like but you go in and you're like these are the teams you've been watching growing up and you're like now i'm here playing them like it's it's weird to think about you're like all right i'm ready to go Lay some yeah, up. let's go in with the big dogs dana green abc4 sports yeah, the Utes will compete as an independent, kind of like BYU does in football, and their first game will be February 1st at home against Vermont.